Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. My name is Trisaya, but I go by Saya. As you can tell by today's title, I'm going to be doing a back to school college dorm haul video. So, I get to show you guys all of the things that I got for my dorm this year. I am attending Old Dominion University. This is my second year, so I am a sophomore. I am studying in nursing, so look out for future videos pertaining to my major. I'm excited to bring you guys on my journey. This year, I'm staying in the village, which is apartment-style dorms. I can't wait to show you guys my room tour and like me moving in. If you're already subscribed, hey girl, welcome back. And if you're not subscribed already, go ahead and hit that button right now because you're missing out on videos already. Okay, so let me get into what I got. I've only accumulated a few things, not a lot this year, since I have a few things from last year already. But I did get decorations and a few essentials, but I haven't got like hygiene and kitchenette stuff yet so that'll be i'll be getting that the day i move in so you guys will either see that in a separate video or in my move in video but let's just get into what i got now so i'm gonna show you guys everything i got from shein and i'll probably put a picture of what those things are as well on the screen so yeah i have a huge box of stuff from Shein and I'm excited. It's going to be a little hard to show you guys these things because they're not assembled and they're like in different packaging but I'm going to try my best. You guys will see a picture as well so don't even worry. So first off I got I got a shoe rack just because I'm in an ap apartment style dorm and I want my shoes to be a little bit more styled this year. I got a little shoe rack and you have to put it together. And it comes with like the instructions. It comes with the instructions as well. But this is a cute little um, organizer, shoe organizer. Next, I got this pink blanket. This is for my bed, obviously. I'm going to show you guys. Oh my god, this is actually so soft. And it's just like a cute little um, um, decoration throw blanket. really cute and actually really soft I am just gonna be pulling stuff out of this box it's not really in order so bear with me next is this organizer it's a clear organizer it's hard to tell right now but I'm pretty sure it's two-tiered and I think I'm gonna put this either on my dresser or on my desk because it's like really cute and I'll have I'm such an organization person. This is actually one of my... I can't tell if it's focusing or in like if it's unfocusing and focusing. But this is one of my favorite items because it was actually pretty cheap compared to what I've seen on like Amazon and stuff. But I got it off of Shein. And it says... Oh, it's upside down. It says my happy place and it's one of those little um LED LED light up um signs. Let me show you guys what it looks like lit um lit up. Sadly, this is one that doesn't come with a block, so I do have to plug it into my own. I don't have a block right now, so I'm going to show you guys. You'll see it still, but I'm not going to physically show you guys. But this is really cute and it's really bright. I'm really excited to put this up in my room. I'm mostly excited to see how my room will look this year. I'm really excited to decorate it and just move in. These six days cannot go any faster. So next I got this little grid. So the story behind this is I thought this came with like four of these. But I guess I didn't read correctly and it came with only one. But this will still be this will still be cute. I can probably like figure out a way to like spice this up and kind of make like a um like a board of stuff. So like this and a whiteboard or maybe a cork board or something. I don't know, but we'll figure it out. 
This is also one of my favorite items because I just love like wooden stuff and like it's just super cute. It came in a pack of four but it's just it's just these clear um, storage containers and you can put like cotton rounds, cotton swabs and stuff in it, q-tips, all that. And I just love that so much. Like I said, it comes in a pack of four. Shein has really stepped up their game. They have a whole bunch of stuff up there. When I mean a whole bunch, I mean literally anything you can name. You'll probably find it on that freaking app now. Next, I actually kind of love this idea. This is like a big hanger. So it's like two big hangers. And then it has slots where you can hang up your stuff and it like minimizes storage or space in your closet. I'm excited to see how this will turn out because I I don't I don't want to say I have a lot of clothes, but I kind of do at the same time. And you guys know college closets aren't the biggest, so this will really come in handy. I wish I had this last year or even in my closet now. The sound of Plastic crinkling is so annoying. I thought this, okay, this I'm kind of disappointed in, but at the same time, it's kind of cool because I don't know what I thought. I thought it was a aroma, like aroma purifier, but it's a mini air purifier. So I'm just going to set this on my desk. But it's actually really cute. It kind of resembles the one I have in my house currently. And you have to plug it in as well. So I'm going to have a lot of stuff plugged in in my room. Which I kind of don't like. But hey. And then you just press the button on top to turn it on. And here's the little um, filter cartridge and such. But yeah, this is like a cute little gadget. It comes with a cord. You obviously need a US. You need a um, block. A, you need a block for this as well. I feel like everything nowadays that you get that need, like that has a cord that comes with it, you need a block to go with it. It kind of sucks. But yeah, this is my mini little purifier. So next, I got these. These are um, wooden shelf, and you can kind of put plants up there or anything you want. I think I'm going to put plants on it because I'm kind of like a plant girly, kind of green girl. Not really, but I really do like plants and I want to get more into my space because I kind of feel like it brightens up the room and I don't know, something about plants, they're just, they're just meant to be in my room. So next I got this and it is a pillowcase. I'm pretty sure this is a long body one. Okay, yes, I was right. I think I thought this came as a pillow, but I don't know at the same time. I think I'm going to fill this up with my... Y'all can't even see. That's how big this is. It has ruffles on the outside, but I think I'm going to buy my own fluff from Walmart or something and fill it up myself. So there's that. You guys will see a picture of this as well because obviously you can't really tell what it is just from what I just showed you. Okay, so next, this is also one of my favorite things as well. These are two pillowcases. Here's the first one. You cannot say this is not cute. I am such a sucker for like floral green, like bright colors like this because... Like, who doesn't love a good, like, floral print? Like, not the crazy floral, like, subtle, cute, you know? And then, of course, it comes with this green. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite color, green. Do y'all see that? That is such a cute color. And then, this is kind of weird, but I have pillows like this. And maybe this will fit over. If not, I think I have more pillows that will fit that will fit these so i'm super excited to see how my bed will come together my freshman year my room was kind of like pink green, pink and green as well with a little bit of like plants and stuff but i think i'm just gonna always keep that theme because it's really so cute and it really describes me 
and like my little um aesthetic if you want to say next i got this um hang up calendar like it's like a calendar and a keychain um holder hopefully i can hang this up right by my door or the entrance of my door um it comes with like the wooden numbers and stuff and dates and yeah this is actually really really cute i loved it so much if i'm being honest i didn't even think to try to match the woods i have in my room but hopefully nobody really pays that much attention to that if you do you're you're doing too much back up a little bit <laughs> so the next thing i purchased from shein is this like green collage and now that i think about it why did i purchase pictures when i can really print them out for free but it's okay i'm gonna try to show you all the prints that are inside that wasn't the smartest move but you guys know when you're shopping like your brain gets the best of you you just pick whatever you think is cute but here are the smaller prints and they also were selling these like something they had four different types of these how do i explain so when i went to five and below they also had like they also had like printouts, um, they're like collages, that's the word. Five and below they had collages, like four different types. It was like city life, green, and something else. I posted it on my TikTok if you guys want to see. It was like college decorations you can find at five and below. Anyways, I'm rambling. Here are some more prints. And they're just like cutesy little green posts. Obviously you can choose what size you prefer. Oh, and they have like, they came with stickers. wonder what's that for. But, and then you have like the larger prints. And the whole point is to like make your own collage. But it's not like I paid crazy money for this. I'm pretty sure it was like $3 or less. The next few things that I got from Shein are like stationary items, I guess you would say. So, I got this today's calendar. I mean, today's planner. And I kind of already have a few planners that I bought from Shein. There's two over there. One of them's a budget planner. And one of them's like a daily planner. But I didn't really like that one. And this one caught my eye. Do you guys see out of that? It just looks so well put together. And then it has like money in, money out. I'm not sure what BLDS stands for. If you guys know what that means. Hopefully it's not BLDS. Yeah, this is actually really cute. And this is like a daily planner. I suggest, especially, especially in college, I suggest that you guys either get a digital planner, use like Canva or Google Calendar or a cute little calendar app that you can find or get you a physical calendar. I'm doing both just so I can hold myself accountable more this year because a daily planner will like get you to have a structured day if that makes sense and then like a digital cal calendar is just for like reminders and events and stuff next i got these pins um i don't know they really stood out to me and i'm such a pin girl especially if i'm gonna be writing in my planner and stuff and sometimes i like to journal as well but let me show you guys these tips first of all do you guys see all of those beautiful colors that come in this but let me just choose this and like the ink is liquid and it says fast drying but look at that look at that tip can y'all see that this is literally perfect perfect writing utensil and i'm not only going to use this in my planner but i'm going to use this in my notes but that's my little pin set and I'm really excited that I got these because I've been wanting a cute pin set for a while now. So this was something I was a little disappointed in when I received because I'm pretty sure it looked way different on the um, sites photo. It was supposed to be a pencil pouch I'm pretty sure. What? What is this? Shein, sorry you guys almost 
like had me satisfied in this whole package you know how like you have at least one thing you don't like in your Shein package this was the one thing like it's cute it says another day of sunshine i thought it was going to be a cute little beige which it is but i think it's the quality and sizing of this like what in the heck am i supposed to fit in this huh hmm what am I fitting in this? I mean, I can try to work something out, but this is definitely not my favorite item. And I forgot, I do have one more decorative, one more decoration item, but I don't think I want to take this out of the roll. So I'm just going to insert the pictures here. This is my little um, plant posters. See, and now I'm thinking about it, I'm going to have... To try to figure out a really cute way to sell my room especially with all these posters on it but this will probably go over my bed or somewhere close to my bed depending on how this works in my head right now but this really stood out to me it could be either or you never know or if I want to change it up and do this in one semester and the, the other stuff the next semester but yeah so I had to play my cards on this one because it was really affordable but I just had to I just had to gamble and see if I put in a little bit of money and get something good quality and I think I did so I got a rug off of Shein and I got a big size rug it's not like a regular size does it shed oh, okay I got a big size um rug not a normal little rug i'll tell you guys the inches by inches or feet by whatever but this thing is so fluffy and it's so nice and soft and look how it goes on and on and on and on and what the heck she in you guys did your big one because i should not have got this for what i did Honestly, this is such a cute thing and I really can't wait to see what my room is going to look like. Okay, so Five and Below didn't let me down. They had a lot of cute stuff, don't get me wrong. But most of the stuff that I saw on TikTok wasn't in my store. So I didn't really get much of anything. But I am definitely going to go back again. I went to one in my city and then I went to one in a different city. And they had a lot of cute stuff, yes. But once, like I said, they didn't have the stuff that I really wanted for my room. So I'm going to show you guys what I got from Five and Below. And it's not a lot. So, yeah. But hopefully next time I go back, I find some good stuff. So, I don't know what I'm going to need these for. But these were $3.25 a piece. And they had different sizes. I just can't get these two. So... I got two clear containers who knows what i'll use these for maybe like hair products and stuff for my room um but they're really cute and subtle five and below had many different sizes of clear containers and they had different types of storage boxes like this as well so next i also don't know what i'm gonna do with this but an ottoman this cheap it is many size but come on this was freaking this was five dollars and i got it in pink so hopefully this is my little pop of pink so this and my um see they're kind of we don't really get into color matching that much because that's a little too much for me i'm not sorry guys but a little pop of pink in the room hopefully this is cute touch it hopefully this is a cute touch if not i'll just return it that's fine but yeah obviously i have a vision in my head and it better come out as nice as i want it to when i get to that room it's same with this right here i don't know what i'm doing with this but it just seemed like i needed it you know when you like look at something you're like i might need that uh yeah but it's a collapsible storage cube but what stood out to me is that it had a top that comes with it as well and the little rope as a handle like 
Sorry. I had to get it. I had to. That was eighteen sixty six for those four for those four items. So that's pretty much everything I got from Five and Below. Probably more to come from them. I mean, they're a pretty good store really good store so last but not least is walmart i have not hit up target yet don't 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 come for me yet target's having a 20 percent off sale for students so i'm waiting till the day i move in to go there and get everything i need and stack up on all the items so i can use my 20 percent discount i'll probably be getting hygiene stuff in like kitchen why am i out of breath whoa I'll probably be getting hygiene kitchen stuff and like bathroom essentials from there. So you guys will see that later. Do not worry. Target is the best when it comes to college essentials. Um, so what can I say? I'll be I'll be going there, don't worry. But let's talk about Walmart real quick. So my grandma kind of hits hooks me up with some stuff from there when she sees it. I got pink towels. I've never had any other color towels besides like black, gray, blue, pink towels. So my, so before our dorms, it's four people in one little housing and then there's, everybody gets their own room, but there's only two bathrooms. So two people have to share one bathroom. My person, like my bathroom mate, I guess you want to say, and I, well, she's my friend, but we're sharing a bathroom and we're gonna do we're doing um peaches like the peaches theme as our bathroom which should be really cute so i decided to get pink it may not match all the way but it doesn't i'm not sure if it's staying in the bathroom or not but i just got pink and i just got two of those for now i'll probably get two more i'm not sure yet though but i got pink I think I'm on bathroom duty for bathroom rug and I have to get that still. I probably will go to TJ Maxx for Ross to find that. If not, Target will probably have it. I'm not sure if I'm a big fan of this, but I got this toilet seat cover that's fuzzy. Now that I'm thinking about it, it's probably kind of dirty to do that. But we'll just see. It'll probably just add a cute touch to the bathroom. It says it's universal, so it should fit on the toilet seat cover when we get to school next i am actually so grateful for this but at the same time oh i think i know where i can use this so my bathroom has a or not my bathroom but my friend and i's bathroom has drawers and stuff in it and i think i can put these in there and probably in my room as well and they're just a 10 piece bath Oh wait, it's a 10 piece storage and it comes with three large, four medium, three small inserts. I could probably use this for my makeup as well. And yeah, it's kind of hard to show you guys what this is, but you guys can kind of get the gist of it. This, this last thing isn't from Walmart, but you can definitely find this at Walmart. This is from Ollie's. My mom got this for me and then this is my comforter set. And she got it in full slash queen size because I'm pretty sure our beds are full this year. Last year they were twin XL. But yeah, you can definitely find this at Walmart. Pretty sure this is Walmart brand. But it's just this white comforter. Can you guys see? It has a little bit of detail to it. Like little white circles. And yeah, so this is really cute. Hopefully I don't mess this up before I end the video I need to show you guys my school supplies it's very simple and sweet I like to use the bare minimum when it comes to school supplies so let me show you what I got obviously from Walmart this ended up being $23 um little backstory I'm taking five classes this first semester so yeah and this is my favorite little hack even though it's not really a hack but a five subject notebook is what I need for my back to not be feeling like bricks. It's in my backpack. Uh, hello. Um, it's so lightweight and it's just, it's kind of, what's the word? Necessary. 
um, efficient, you know, all the words that I can't think of right now. <laughs> you pretty much end up using this for at least three out of your five classes, if not four out of five, but yeah. This right here, old trusty, faithful notebook. I definitely recommend you guys to get at least a three subject. You know, have two, three subjects if you don't want a whole bunch of like spiral. It depends on what type of note taker you are, you know. I got this type of um, pencil pouch. I've always wanted this, to be honest. Um, spent $5 on this, about 4 to $5. It's a self-standing pencil pouch. Hopefully all of my pencils and stuff fit in here. I might have to end up putting my cute color pencils that I show you, my cute colored pens that I show you guys showed you guys earlier. But I got some big pencils. These are mechanical. Um I usually go with those one type of pencils. I can't remember the name currently, but you guys probably know what I'm talking about. We all had them in middle school. We used to lose them after the first week of school. Yeah, that, those pencils. But I got these. I'm trying to be more proactive in my studying this year and writing it out instead of like studying differently just by reading stuff instead of actually practicing. So, I got some dry erase board markers because my school has a lot of resources and a lot of like study hacks and stuff. Not study hacks, but like they have dry erase boards basically anywhere you go, any building you go in, they'll have a huge dry erase board for you guys to um, study or whatever on. Sometimes even like the building I stayed in last year, which was Owens, our residence hall, they had um big dry erase boards and like the study rooms and stuff it was pretty cool and i wish i utilized them more last year because it definitely would have helped me but we're growing and we fix our mistakes right, right. and lastly this is literally all that i need except for maybe some more pencils or something but sharpie highlighters please guys i don't think i've ever used this blue before and i'm actually really excited to use it this year I got some Sharpie highlighters, old trusty. That's all of the school supplies I need for this year. Well, for the first semester at least. And if I need more, I'll just go to the store and buy it, of course. And usually they tell you what you need for the class. I probably will need a binder for one of my classes if I'm being honest or something. But so that's pretty much everything that I'm going to be bringing to school besides like the stuff that I said that I have to get. But that's pretty much everything. Um, you don't really need a lot when it comes to college. If anything, you can always buy it when you get there. The school isn't far from me, so it's not that bad for me to um, bring a little bit at a, at a time. But that's everything that I'm bringing this year. Hopefully this is everything that I need for decorating and my vision comes to mind or my vision comes to life when I move in. But yeah that's everything for this video thank you guys so much for watching if you're not subscribed go ahead and subscribe right now give this video a big thumbs up and comment what day you move in and what college you're going to this year and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video bye